Hello, I'm Disco Dinosaur, and welcome to a new series that is basically me showing some gameplay of the free games each month. Um, I will be giving my opinion whether it's worth the download or not. So basically, just sit back and watch me suck really bad at most of these games. Especially the one that's for this month. It really sucked. Anyways, the first game review I'm doing is on a previous game that was for actually the second one for last month I believe in February it was called Project Cars um this game was eh it was eh, eh, eh that's all I can say really very I'm not much really into racing unless it's on GTA 5 pretty much even then I kind of suck and I used to play a shit ton of Burnout back in the day when I was on the, the original Xbox I loved that game a lot but I have to say if it's fucking hard to turn or fucking drift in this game. Literally, I'm smashing the walls trying to fucking turn. I can't figure out the brakes. I think the brakes is RB. I think. I doubt it. I can't find the controls at all in this game. It's really hard. Like, it's fucking hard. To turn. I fucking hate it. Like, I was sucking really bad at turning. It was like, where the fuck is the button? I don't know. Ugh. Fuck. It. I suck at racing, but at least I'm decent enough to turn, so I don't- I doubt it's not me. I hope it's not me. But, other than that, the graphics was decent. Um, they tried to really immerse you into the game. Like, they made it- you probably see that it looks like I'm, you're driving the car, and then if you have your headset on, it's really loud. Like, the headset- and I accidentally hit my mic, I'm sorry about that. But, um... It feels like you're driving it, even in, like I said, you put your headset on, and it sounds like you're really driving the game and everything, but, I don't know. I don't think it's really worth the download, but still, eh, it's up to you if you really like the racing game scene or not. I don't like it that much, this game. It's not really the most fun at all. It sucked. It really sucked, especially when you can't turn for shit. I can't turn, unless you go really slow and then you lose your place. But yeah, that's why I think of that game. Now for the other game, it is a horror game. It's called Layers of Fear. It's a horror game where your actions can change the ending. At least that's what I got from it. Like, whatever you do in the game, it changes. But you you really walk really slow as fuck. But what you expect for most horror games that are like this, it's you walk slow for the fucking thing. But, it's a game that really did keep me on my toes. I'm a big horror fanatic, so I'm used to playing games like this. It's, I don't know if I already had the shock to it. Well, not the shock, like, I don't really play horror games that much anymore because I lose that sense of fear. I don't know. Things jump scare at you, but it's usually the same thing. I really like a good horror game that has a good story, like Dead Space. I really enjoyed it a lot. But this game, it was something I could really get into, actually, Layers of Fear. It's not something like... Like, oh, huh, it's like another rip-off of Amnesia or, Out or Outlast or Outcast. Outcast is the band. Outlast's game. Remember that? I doubt I will. But any horror. Um, the graphics were really good. Like, it felt like it was really good. And I was just playing this at night, of course. And it was really good just hearing and looking around. And it kind of gave me that sense of Amnesia, if anybody knows what that game is. I de probably do. It was really popular. With all the video gamers recording and shit. But, like I said, the graphics are good. Um, I definitely, I didn't play too much into it because I, I'm thinking about doing my own Let's Play in it. Because I think it'd be fun just to watch my reactions. Because I'm not really, I'm not saying I don't get scared. I'm just saying, like, it's hard to get me to be like, oh, screaming. Like, how you see a lot of people on YouTube. So, but I say it's worth the download. And I'll say I'll definitely play it some more soon. Now for the next game is Borderlands 2. It is a, of course, it's a action first person shooter game. This game was originally on the 360, but now it's backwards compatibility. It had been for a while, but now it's free. So anybody who doesn't want to spend the five bucks, I guess, well, I don't know how much it is now. It's a really popular game still. Um, it's actually, I enjoyed it when I first played it a long time ago. So it's not much really much to say. Um, you're basically a vault hunter. It's of course it's a second. It's a sequel. Oops, sorry, I almost burped there. And then I really love the character Clapchat. He's one of my favorite. He's funny as fuck. The sarcastic little fuck. 
Um, the game, the game's graphics are decent for its time. Um, but I do enjoy playing again. It was nice a little homage. Again, I didn't play too much into it because I played this game out so much, like I do with Skyrim. It's one of those games where I can go back and play it over and over, so I didn't play it too much when it first came back out. I already had it, too. But, basically, you pick a character and you go around shooting shit on Pandora, which is the planet you're you're on. And I'm not going to tell you much else about it because, it, it, like I said, it's one. It's like a really old game, so you, everyone should know by now what Borderlands is. The iconic little, little fuck on the, on the cover. There I go, sittering. But... Yeah, I say it's worth the download if you want to go download and play it yourself. I think it's a really fun game. It's worth it for, I don't know how much space it is. But that's it for this episode. Um, Next episode will probably just be like single. Well, I guess because there will be the Xbox One and then 360 free game. So I'll be doing two reviews. This one only did three because we had the last month I didn't do. Now I'm doing this month. But yeah. Well, if you guys enjoyed this video, I hope you guys do. Thank you for watching, and see you guys all in the next video. Bye.